finding scholarly articles with academic search complete. When you need a few good scholarly articles on a topic, Academic Search Complete is a great place to start. It covers thousands of journals, newspapers, and magazines on a wide range of topics. Let's assume we need to find articles on bullying among teenagers on social media. The first thing we want to do is to think of search terms for each of the key concepts of our topic. In this case, social media, bullying, and teenagers. If we were searching Google, we might search the whole topic at once, bullying among teenagers on social media. But searching a database of articles is different. Typically, each word you search has to exactly match the words in the article title, very brief summary, and a few keywords or subject terms. If, for example, Facebook is used instead of social media, the article won't be retrieved. Okay, so for each of the three concepts, we will add a few synonyms or related words. Now let's try our search. Academic Search Complete is on the Try These First list at the bottom of the library homepage. If you find yourself in the basic search mode when you enter the database, switch to Advanced Search so you have more search options. Let's start by searching for our three key concepts, social media, bullying, and teenagers. In most databases, and in Google as well, it's a good idea to enclose words you want to search only as a phrase in quotes, so we're using them around social media. Now let's see our results. We specifically need scholarly articles for our assignment. Academic Search Complete, like most article databases, lets us limit our search to scholarly, peer-reviewed articles. Using the slider bar, we could also limit by publication date if we wanted, but I'll just check the scholarly articles box and then update the search. That search only brought in two articles. I think we need to expand our search by adding some related words from our list. I'm going to combine them using OR in caps, which tells the database we will accept either bullying or cyberbullying. If we search bullying and cyberbullying, both of those words would have to be there in the same article for it to be selected. By default, the articles are displayed by date with the most recently published ones first. If your search brings back pages of results, it's often very helpful to sort them by relevance. If date is important, you can limit it with the slider on the left. Now we have a number of interesting articles on our list. Academic Search Complete has a nice feature to help us determine which articles might be relevant. If we hover over the magnifying glass icon, we can read the abstract of each article. We could also read it by clicking on the title of the article. We see several relevant articles. At this point, we want to get the full text, the entire article to read. If a link to full text PDF appears, the article is available right here from Academic Search Complete. If it's not, the blue Get It button helps us to get the full article from other databases the library subscribes to. This article is available from another database, and when we click on Article, we'll be taken to it. Once in another database, we may need to navigate to the article via the table of contents. Each database interface is a little different. Most often, we will see the article title and abstract just like this. Look for a link to the full text. Often the article can be viewed either as just a web page or as a PDF, an Adobe Acrobat file. If a PDF copy is available, it's best to use it because a PDF is exactly like a photocopy of the paper article. When you refer to it in your paper, you can use the actual page numbers. In Academic Search Complete and most other databases, articles can be printed, emailed, and saved. Citation formatting help is also available. Be sure to check the citation to make sure it's correct. 
Academic Search Complete is just one of hundreds of databases available through university libraries. If you don't find what you're looking for, or if you want to do a more comprehensive search on a topic, check the subject guides for a specialized database that focuses on one discipline, like education, psychology, or biology. Another excellent tool for finding scholarly articles is our Google-like Lion Search, covered in another tutorial. Whatever the topic, whatever the database, remember, if you have questions, please ask a librarian. We're here to help.